Hey bunnies, welcome to another Naked Sunday video. Now before we start, go ahead and grab yourself a drink. I am drinking vodka, of course. It's regular plain old vodka with Sprite and then a little splash of juice. You can use any juice you want. What I have is, it's from Welch's, I believe, or Tropicana, one of them, the ones that come in the box with a little corkscrew thing on the top. And it's the passion fruit cherry. Just a little splash of that. There's also one that comes in a yellow box. It's something another limeade or lemonade, something. So good. Vodka sprites and any type of juice, even if it's just a lime juice, so good. Go ahead, grab your drink. I have three cups of ice, two, three cubes of ice, <laughs> two straws, and let's go. As you can see from the title of the video, we're going to be talking about balls. The licking and sucking of them in particular. No, it's funny that I got this topic because it was suggested to me to do. I went to this head class, well, head doctor class with one of my friends. Her name is Kimmy Lavage, Kimmy for short. You have seen her in my um, video called My First Anal Experience or something like that. And if you're coming to Naked Sunday Full Frontal on June 3rd of 2018 this year, you will see her again she's going to be one of the vendors there at the events and she'll have all her, all of her toys all her play things she'll be dropping knowledge as usual at the event so make sure you guys come through if you want to see her in person if you want to meet her seeing her on the video and want to see who she is meet her whatever whatever i keep saying meet her over and over but you're pretty much yeah you're going to be meeting her anyways rambling so like i was saying it's funny that this topic was given to me because the head doctor class was i think two weeks ago not this past saturday but the saturday before right and in the video actually by the time you see this it'll be like the other saturday so not this saturday not last saturday but the saturday before that okay <laughs> and she did we it, it's a head doctor class it's about giving head and sucking and licking and all that stuff and I did start to vlog that weekend, but it just didn't work out. And I didn't want to put people on camera who were just, you know. And then for certain things, I don't like vlogging the whole thing. Rambling again. Anyway, she was talking about the licking and sucking of balls. So a little bit of what she said, pretty much everything she said is what I agree with. And you'll be hearing some of that in this video right now. Ball sucking and, and licking. We already did dick sucking, right? Now ball sucking. The balls... Of the man's penis are very sensitive they're very sensitive that's where the life is okay that is where he gives life okay now when it comes to licking and sucking here are my rules if your balls are hairy they're not going to get licked and sucked and that's just plain cold hard facts no shade, no tea. Just, matter of fact, all tea, all shade, all offense. All shade, all tea, all offense. I don't care. Wax your balls, shave your balls. If you want your balls licked and sucked, you should not have any hair on it. Unless you have those little peach fuzz hairs, so those little really soft, nice ones where you can barely see it or feel it. That's different. Okay? If you want me to be slobbing on your knob and licking and sucking your balls, get that situation taken care of i need you to manscape i don't care if it makes you feel like you're queer or gay or homo or metro or whatever i don't care if you want that to be taken care of by your partner do something about it okay okay wax it shave it laser hair remove it men don't want to hear about for suck out like part okay so that's the first thing now at the head doctor class right they were making fun of this there are some guys out there who have saggy saggy scrotum but the balls are in there right so what they do is like pop up the balls through the sack and they suck on that to give the guy the pleasure and the sensation he wants if you're with a guy who has saggy balls or saggy scrotum then you want to just you know pop the ball like a little marble in a pouch and suck on that while you're sucking on the balls is the great time to get towards the taint now the taint is the space between the sack and the butthole now for a lot of guys this is a very sensitive area they don't want it touched they don't want it licked they don't want it looked at for a lot of other guys they love it they will actually spread eagle for you and i've had one instance like that and it freaks me out completely i 
I I was like, nope. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. And I was doing, I was into yoga at that time. So when he did it, I was like, okay, who are you going to? Like, um, mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. no, sir, I wasn't with it. To me, it made him, and it's no shade, like literally, honestly, if that's you, if that's what you want to do, if that's your preference, go ahead and do it. But for me personally, it's not my cup of tea. I don't want to see my man spread out like that in front of me, waiting for me to lick him like, here, come have it. No, I'm not licking your taint. I'm not licking your taint. I'll take my hand, I'll take a finger if I'm giving you a blowjob or if I'm giving you a hand job, and I'll start to rub it because I know you like it. You know, and to me, especially if you have hairy balls, if you have hairy balls, your taint is not getting licked. Okay, like it's just not happening, sir. I'm very sorry. Now, if your balls are waxed or shaved or lace or hair removed, an exception can be made. Just those skin out like a big dot together playing dandy shandy. You know what? This video is coming off very offensive and I hope I'm not offending any of the gentlemen out there who do like to spread their legs all the way open. And if you are that guy, I am so sorry if you find this offensive. <sighs> okay. All right. But ladies, if you do want to suck and lick on your man's balls, go ahead and do so by all means. I just want you to know that hair balls are no fun. You might get, you know, some stuff between your teeth. It might fly down your throat or you might choke. It has happened to me before. So take my word of advice. Take these precautions. If your man wants you to suck and lick on his balls, let him know that there will be rules and stipulations. Okay? And if you don't have no rules and stipulations, then good for you, sis. Do you but for me personally i do have rules but i don't want to know here about it on my face i am very sorry no i feel like i'm straying off topic completely because when this person sent this this topic suggestion to me i don't think this is what they meant this is what they wanted me to do i'm literally just rambling and telling what i don't like um so yeah but this drink is so good <laughs> balls are very sensitive you're going to be giving head you don't really don't want to forget the balls. And if you don't want to lick and suck the balls, you really don't have to. You can just, you know, play with them with your fingers. You know, play with them with your hands. Be gentle, like caress them. You know, you know, a little thing, a little palm motion there. And then while you're doing that, you know, you're playing with the taints a little bit. You know, yeah. And then you have some guys who actually like a little bit of butt play. Have yet to meet that guy. <laughs> And if you are that guy, please go ahead and leave it in the comment section below. Let us know if you like or don't like butt play, but you are completely heterosexual. It's completely normal, so I don't want anyone to feel like it's something that's not okay to do. You like your butt grab during sex, that's great. You like your butthole tickle a little bit during sex, that's great. That's your life. No judgment here at all. Just make sure that you're nice and clean. The same way you want your female counterparts to be nice and clean and well shaven and laser hair removal. <laughs> it's the same thing we expect of you because equality matters. Hair balls are not a, are a thing of the past. 2018, everybody's like, oh, 2018, you still have a hair pum pum? You still have hairy balls, sir? Where they do that at? And in conclusion, yes, you should play with your man's balls. Yes, you should suck and lick on your man's balls. If your man has hairy balls and you have a problem with his hairy balls, tell him because communication is key. Okay? Have a drink. Relax. If you want your balls sucked and licked on, tell your girl or your guy or whoever. Tell your partner. Tell your partner that you're missing out on all these things that Kissy Base is talking about because you want to know. You want your taint licked and rubbed on. You've never had a taint rubbed on? Listen. 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 Based on the reactions I've seen from the taints rubbing, get your taint rubbed. Get your taint rubbed. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, peace sign and... Kissy face. Bye. Cheese. Kissy face. Bunnies. So, quick question. Do you want to film a Naked Sunday video with me?
If yes, which I'm hoping the answer is yes, now is the perfect time to film with me. Click the link in the description bar below so you can get full access to the very first live taping of Naked Sunday. I'm gonna bring two of your favorite, of my favorite girlfriends. We are going to have an open bar, we're gonna have giveaways, we're gonna have pictures, and of course, we're going to be talking sex right how fun is that so if you want to be part of the very first filming of the what am i going to call this naked sunday full frontal <laughs> click the link in the description bar below for more info